Lynn, welcome to the 2027 Nobel Prize Awards in Sweden, in Stockholm, Sweden. We are gathered here to celebrate the innovative mind of the last century. Like every year, our greatest scientists tackle the world's pro world problems, try and tackle, like, try and tackle hunger, try and make the world green again. But I am honored today, I am honored today to administer the awards, the awards for the Nobel Prize in Physics. Firstly, this man is very well respected among his peers. He graduated from college in Harvard and got his PhD in Stanford University. He has been the spearhead in many researches, researches specifically to those concerning space and the universe. One of his most famous works, one of his most famous works called Jumbled Jumbo reality proves that quantum entanglement is a thing. This is basically the theory that says that when two electrons are created at the same time, like anything that happens to one can happen to another. That's basically, in other words, like if you send, you basically can spontaneously send information from any part of the universe at the same time, regardless of the distance. Like that's what basically, and it's weird because that kind of breaks the laws of. EMC square because like nothing good faster than light, but like this says that in this certain situation it can. He is also he also has a theory of quantum foaming, which says that it, this also breaks the theory of third thermodynamics, which says that nothing comes out of anything. Like nothing comes out of nothing. Like, there's always something that makes something. By saying that particles sometimes just like pop up, pop out of nowhere and you can just like but like they, they do it so quickly, so it doesn't technically break break the laws. Like, it's not like a debt, kind of like the universe takes like a debt from itself and say, okay, I'm going to make this molecule for a second and it's going to do so, 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 so. But after a while, it's going to go away. So, like, we basically observe it for like a few seconds. And this, we, we can only observe it through hydrogen, through hydrogen radiation. Like, so, and all this, this, this knowledge can only come from one mind. And his name is Steve Iko. Welcome to the stage.